All right guys, so this is the physics draft board system. So you can see I've got that here and I've got a drink right there to show you. So I figured I'd give you a breakdown quick of what's included. Um, you get the charger and that goes right into the back of the device there. But basically with this, you've got the tap handle up here up top. It's gonna come out of here. Um, this is just kind of like a little catch tray. This does come out. So if you want to take this out and you know rinse it off, if you've got some water, you know, drink stuff in here, you can. Uh, but basically, if you just twist this bottom here, we'll twist it to the side. You can kind of see then it'll twist and then this will lift up. So that's where your drink is going to go. You just set it in there. On the underside of this, that little spout is what goes into either your can. You're going to stick that right in the can hole or in your bottle, whatever you're using. So that's going to be what draws up the fluid and uh, gets it up through the tap here. So that'll just get lined back up then when you're done. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this up. I'm going to show you exactly how you use it and kind of what results you get. All right, guys. So I've got a full-size glass here, just a pine glass. I'm going to show you just so you can kind of see uh, what it looks like in the glass and everything. But you're going to... Crack your drink open. So like I said, then you pull that up. So this piece here is gonna go inside there. So you're just gonna line that up. So it's in the can. You put that down, you give it a twist. So you're just twisting it this way. That's lined up here again. So you basically wanna hold your beer at a 45 degree angle, your glass, as you're getting it. So you kinda hold it like this. As it fills, you kind of tip it back up. Um, if you reverse this, it will give more foam. So I honestly think sometimes you don't even need to do that. Let me show you here. So if we go, it's gonna start the normal process of filling this up. And you're gonna see, you're gonna get a little bit of foam. So I honestly would probably just let that go and then you're gonna see it's got a nice foamy head on there. And then that will dissipate a little bit to where it's kind of, you know, I'd say normal to where then you go out and drink it. But that is what it looks like. You can see, so that's with an IPA. You can see very frothy there, which is exactly what you want. So usually what I'll do here is I'll fill it up like this. I'll open this back up. Usually then there's a little bit left in here and then you can just basically top it off the rest of the way. And I mean, that's a pretty good finished product in my opinion. So whether you're using this for like IPA, stouts, uh, whatever you're gonna use it for, it does in my opinion change the taste. It does make it better. It gives you that frothy head on there. And um, there's definitely a difference when we did a taste test from like A to B, you can definitely tell. Um, I feel like there is a little bit more flavor. You know, I say a lot of the time anyway, a lot of the flavor you get is from kind of the, the head of this and kind of the smell and everything as you're tasting. So uh, it's definitely something that I think it does kick it up a notch. It's not completely a gimmick. You can see it does give a nice good head on here compared to say just drinking it out of the can. So it's something I would definitely recommend. It's a cool, neat little device. If you have a beer lover in your life, I think it's a great gift. Um, birthday gift, Christmas gift, whatever you wanna get it for. Basically just plug it in. And then what I typically do then to uh, clean this, you can either fill up this or like say if you have a glass bottle, I typically fill it up with warm water and then you basically just run it one time with the water through it and then that's gonna clean it out. I'm very happy with it. I think it's a pretty cool product. Check it out.